I have to play in a tennis tournament at the club. Believe me, sweetie, I wouldn't be playing in this tournament if your father hadn't insisted on it. Oh, now, 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 it can't be that bad. Yeah? Why don't you take my place? That's my girl. I love you. Bobby, go upstairs and brush your teeth. I don't want Mrs. Gunn to have to wait for you. I'll see you after school. Bye. Hi, honey. Guess what, Mom? What? I hope you don't mind us helping Bobby with his pitching. Oh, no, not at all. I'm Jonathan Smith, my partner, Mark Gordon. Hello, Hi. I'm Penny Martin. Nice to meet you. Hi. Isn't that neat? Oh, yes, honey, but I don't want you to take advantage. You got yourself quite a ball player here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, excuse me, Mark, Jonathan, if you'd reconsider that rain check, we would love you to have dinner with us tonight. Thanks, Mom. Oh, okay, Mr. Baseball Player. Come on. Would you check on Bobby? He won't wash his hair unless you help him. Thank you. Louise is the best. I really don't know how we'd ever get along without her. See, Bill and I have lost our parents, and ever since Bobby was a baby, he's always looked to Louise to help fill the role of Grandma. Didn't realize Bill was still so upset about his mother's death. Oh, I'm sure he'll be all right, Jonathan. It's just that, uh, well, he doesn't like to discuss it with anyone. Not even me. Seems like you're getting home later and later. Well, I'm sure it's very flattering. But, Bill, look how many hours you have to work. Maybe you ought to think about cutting back just a little. Bill, all you have to do is look around. You've already given us more than we could ever want. But, honey, at what point do you say enough is enough? Honey, what's the matter? And me and Billy got really excited. Well, honey, that's good news. Billy's family is black. Listen, honey, everything is going to be just fine. You go on up to bed, okay? Okay. Of course not. Honey, everything's going to be okay. Just don't worry. Bill, I can't believe Brad would say something like that, especially in front of Bobby. What? You don't think Bobby would make something like that up, do you? All right, fine. You talk to him. You hungry? I made some stew. I'll heat it up. Bill. I can't believe you'd ask a question like that. All right. I'll give you an answer. It won't bother me whether the people next door turn out to be black, blue, or polka dot. Because I plan on being a good neighbor to them. And I only hope they plan to do the same for me. Thank you. The world welcomed me with open arms. Even Mission Estates loves me. <laughs>